Hello and welcome to Lisana Crochet and part two of this uh, pride top or rainbow top, however you want to call it. And in this part, we're just gonna continue working. We have uh, around 25 rows left to make, so we did basically half, and we have half more. And that's it, then we're gonna add the straps for the neck, and that's about it. So, let's uh, continue this pattern. So, we did 76 half double crochet, and two in the same stitch, two in the same stitch. This is from part one. And now we're gonna chain two and we're gonna start row 26. We're gonna turn and we're gonna work two hard double crochet in the same stitch, the first. And two hard double crochet in the next one, in the same stitch. Now we're gonna work 36 hard double crochet until the middle point. So I did 36 half double crochet. Now I will chain one, skip one, two half double crochet. Chain one, skip one, two half double crochet. Skip one, chain one, two half double crochet. Chain one, skip one, and we work thirty five. Half double crochet until the end where we're gonna work to in the same stitch to in the same stitch but for now just chain one skip one and 35 half double crochet now work to half double crochet in the same stitch And two in the last stitch together. Chain two and we start row 27. We're gonna do two half double crochet in the first stitch. Two half double crochet in the next stitch. And 84 half double crochet until we get to the end. I did 84 half double crochet. Now I will do two half double crochet in the same stitch and two half double crochet in the last one. I will chain two, I will turn, and we're gonna start row 28 with two half double crochet in the same stitch, two da half double crochet in the next stitch, and we're gonna work 40 half double crochet. Now we're gonna chain one, skip one, two half double crochet, chain one, skip one, two half double crochet, chain one, skip one, 
to hull double crochet chain one skip one and we walk 39 39 half double crochet now we're gonna work to half double crochet in the next stitch and two in the last stitch chain two turn we're gonna start to go 29 with two half double crochet in the first stitch and two in the next one now we're gonna work 92 half double crochet I did 92 half double crochet now I will do two half double crochet in the next stitch and two half double crochet in the last stitch chain two turn two half double crochet in the first stitch two half double crochet in the next stitch this is row 30 and we're gonna do 44 half double crochet I will chain one skip one to half double crochet chain one skip one to half double crochet chain one skip one to half double crochet chain one skip one and we're gonna work 43 half double crochet I'm at the end of the row I will do two half double crochet in the next stitch and two half double crochet in the last stitch chain two now we're gonna start row 31 we're gonna turn we're gonna work two half double crochet in the first stitch and two half double crochet in the next one And now we're gonna work 100 half double crochet until the end. So I did 100. Now I will do two half double crochet in the same stitch and two half double crochet in the next. Chain two, three, now we're gonna start row 32, I will do two half double crochet in the first stitch Two half double crochet in the next one. Forty-eight half double crochet until the middle. Forty-nine 
I did 48, chain one, skip one, two half double crochet, chain one, skip one, two half double crochet. Chain one, skip one, and two half double crochet. Chain one, skip one, and we work forty seven. We skip this one, and we work after that forty seven half double crochet. I did 47 half double crochet. Now I will do two half double crochet in the next stitch and two half double crochet in the last. Chain two, turn, over here. We're gonna do two half double crochet in the first stitch and two half double crochet in the second stitch. This is row 33 by the way and we're gonna continue working 108 half double crochet. Now we are gonna do two half double crochet in the same stitch and two half double crochet in the next one. I will not close this one because we're gonna add the blue color. I have this blue I will add it here to this half double crochet so we change the colors between row 33 and row 34 and we're gonna do chain 2 now I will cut this tail the green one and we start row 34 I will do two half double crochet in the first stitch two half double crochet in the next stitch 52 half double crochet Chain one, skip one, two half double crochet. Chain one, skip one, two half double crochet. Chain one, skip one, two half double crochet. Chain one, skip one. And we work 51 half double crochet. And now at the end of the row, work two half double crochet in the same stitch and two half double crochet in the next, in the last 
from the row. Chain two, turn, We're gonna start row 35 with, with two hard double crochet in the first stitch, two hard double crochet in the second stitch, and we're gonna work 116 hard double crochet until the end of the row. 116. So I did 116, now I will do two half double crochet in the next stitch, and two half double crochet in the last, chain two, turn, and we are gonna start row 36, with two half double crochet in the first stitch, Two half double crochet in the next stitch, and we're gonna do fifty six half double crochet until the middle. Chain one, skip one, two half double crochet. Chain one, skip one, two hard double crochet. Chain one, skip one, two hard double crochet. Chain one, skip one, and we do fifty five hard double crochet. Now we're gonna work two half double crochet in the same stitch and two half double crochet in the last stitch chain two turn and we're gonna work two half double crochet in the first stitch and two half double crochet in the second stitch. This is row 37 and work 124 half double crochet until the end of the row. I did 124 half double crochet. Now I will do two half double crochet in the same stitch, two half double crochet in the next stitch, chain two, we gonna turn, and we gonna start row 38. For row 38, the pattern is gonna change. So this is what we have now. I cannot fit it in the screen, but it is almost complete. We have just a few more rows to do and that's it. And now, and now for th row 38, we're gonna do like this. So I chain two, and from here on, we will stop increasing. So I go directly and I work 62 half double crochet until the middle. So no more increasing.
I will chain two. I skip one and I do two half double crochet. Chain one, skip one and two half double crochet. Chain one, skip one and two half double crochet. Chain one, skip one and we work sixty one half double crochet until the end without increasing. So it is at until the very end here. 61 so I'm at the end of the row over here at the very end of the row like I have no stitches left So I worked 61 half double crochet. Now I chain two, I turn. And I start row 39. In row 39, we will not start with an increase like we did until now. We're gonna start directly and we're gonna work 133 half double crochet until the end of the row. So all we do is half double crochet, a total number of 133. So I have here 133 half double crochet, I worked until the end, I have no stitches left, so no increasing. And now I need to tell you because the next 10 rows they're gonna repeat identical like the last two rows. We're gonna do this way. I will show you what you have to do and you're gonna do it by yourself because this video is gonna take too long if I try to record everything so I have to cut it a little because it's a lot of repeating now and I will tell you now what you have to do so last row we did 62 half double crochet until the middle and then we work 61 half double crochet with no increasing okay and next row we chain two and we did 133 half double crochet okay so here we have row 38 that we already did with 62 and then 61 okay so after that we work on row 39 where we did 133 half double crochet Row 40 is gonna be the same as row 38, 62 half double crochet, then we do the middle part and then 61. After that row 41 is gonna be like row 39 with 133 and so on we continue until we get to row 49. We have 10 rows that they repeat the same. Okay. The only point that I want to do is here when we work these rows and we get to row 43. After row 33, when we finish row 33, we're gonna do a change of color. We're gonna change from blue to purple. So here we're gonna work with blue and we when we get to row 43 and when we start row 44 we go with purple until row 49. 
okay? So we meet at the end of row 49. Please don't forget to change to purple because we need this to be in all the rainbow colors, okay? We have here the red. We have the orange. It looks red in the video, but it's orange in real life for me. Maybe you have a better uh, type of orange. Then we have yellow, green, and blue. And after that, purple is gonna follow. So we meet at the end of row 49 and we're gonna continue from there because there is a little more to do, but very little. After row 49, we're just gonna finish the project with row 50 and then we're gonna go here at the beginning and we're gonna make the tie for the neck so we can like tie it around our neck, right? <laughs> Yes, so we meet at the end of row 49, yeah. So I finished row 49 over here, this is row 49 and we're gonna chain only one before row 50 and we turn. Row 50 is gonna be the finishing row and I'll show you how we're gonna do it. Over here in the first chain, uh, in the first stitch that I have, I will work a slip stitch. So I will just go in and I will work a slip stitch. I will chain three and I go to the next stitch. I don't skip, just directly to the next and I do another slip stitch like this. Chain three slip stitch in the next stitch and so on we do chain three slip stitch chain three slip stitch with no skipping between directly chain three slip stitch And you see it creates this very nice effect at the edge. I don't know if you can notice. But you saw it in the photos from the beginning. The edge is like not straight anymore. It creates this like waves. Which is very beautiful. So continue like this until the end of the row and we meet there. So I finished row 50, this is how the edge looks like. And now all we're gonna do is creating the straps to put it like this around the neck. And that's about it. This is the last thing we're gonna do right now. So, to create this, we're gonna take the red color because we started with red, we also have to add the red. So, what uh, we're gonna do it is a chain 85, but like this, not attached to the work. 
okay just I, I will go directly and I will chain 85 Now we gonna attach it to the body, okay? To the top of the body, not the bottom, okay? The top. So I did the uh, 85 chains, and now in the first stitch that I can find over here at the beginning, okay? I will do a half double crochet. So my next stitch is a half double crochet. And I'll work half double crochet until I get to this other side. That means in total of 31 half double crochet. I did 35. Now I will uh, do a chain 85 so I have also on this side so I did 85 and now I will do one more chain I will skip the first one that we did the extra one and in the next one I will do two single crochet in the next stitch and we're gonna do this for 20 chains so I did two single crochet in the first chain I go to the next chain and I do two single crochet in the same chain two single crochet in the next chain and this is what we do for 20 chains two single crochet in each 20 chains now I will do a slip stitch in the next stitch and one slip stitch in each chain so I will the list of 65 slip stitches And now we're gonna do like we did here on the bottom, the same idea. So I will do a slip stitch in the first half double crochet of this row. I'll do a slip stitch, I'll chain three, and I'll do another slip stitch in the next stitch. Chain three, slip stitch, chain three slip stitch and so on until we get to the other side so I did the slip stitch chain 3 slip stitch chain 3 look how pretty it looks now the edge my last stitch is a slip stitch not a chain 3 but a slip stitch and I will continue working just one slip stitch without the chain in each chain until we get to 65 65 slip stitch let's go so I did the 65 slip stitch and now I have 20 chains left over here and I will do in the next stitch, so in the stitch 66, I will do two single crochet in the same stitch. I have one, two. And we're gonna continue like this until the end, working two single crochet, same stitch, two single crochet, same stitch, and so on. And this is uh, this is the end of the project. After this, we're gonna wave in all the ends.
And that's about it.